top of the morning to you lads. I'm in Tehachapi, California. That's where I'm currently sitting. Uh, it's, it's getting hot over here, man. What is it, 70 degrees outside? It's getting a little warm. I'm gonna get on out of this desert. Well, I'm not getting out of the desert anytime soon. I'm gonna be in the desert all the way through Texas. I was thinking about getting some coffee here, but then I realized that I'm like 70 something miles away from Barstow. I think I'm just gonna make my way to Barstow, land, get some Starbucks, take off again. That's my, for now, for the next like two hours, that's my game plan, all right? For the rest of the day, it, I have no plan. It, who knows what'll happen? I'm just, I'm just improvising for the rest of the day. But for the next two hours, I have a plan. Stopping in Barstow, picking out some Starbucks, and, take, and taking off again into the wild. So that is my plan for the next two hours. So won't, won't you come join me on that great adventure of getting my hands on some uh, on a frappuccino or something of that sort I gotta say, Arizona's pretty and everything. But if only they, they fixed the roads, you know? It would, I would like Arizona a lot more if they fixed the roads. Cause it's really, it's pretty, that's for sure. It's got, it's got scenery, you know? The sunsets here never fail to amaze. But the roads, man, the roads really just give you a nice pounding. Well, I got some fuel and I had some food. I had some of my uh, Slavic food, which is pretty good. I'm really glad I packed it. I gotta say, man, it saves time because I don't have to order food. And yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Glad I did that. Good call, good call on my part. Uh, let's see, I drove, 298 miles so I still got quite a ways to go today it'd be nice if I do another 300 because um, you know I went through California so that slowed me down a bit so if I do another 300 I'll consider that a successful day but without further ado I'm gonna head head out because I don't have, I don't want to waste too much time, you know, I want to get there as soon as possible so that I can unload in the morning at 8 o'clock. So I want to get there as soon as, on Sunday night, but not too late, because then my 10 hour. Anyway, off I go again, embarking on yet another adventure. Who knows what lies ahead? Hopefully nothing in the middle of the road.
It's cold in New Mexico. I'm in Midland at a Dairy Queen. There's a Dairy Queen here that has truck parking. It's not very big, but there aren't very many people here. And then there's also a parking area across the street from here. So, yeah. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice at Dairy Queen. Way to go, Dairy Queen in Midland, New Mexico. Exit 72 for all, for all you truckers out there. But yeah, I did about 680 something miles today, which is pretty good considering I started in Tehachapi, California along the 58 and then I drove who knows how many miles to Needles going 55 miles an hour. So some decent mileage in there, some decent mileage. I'll take it. I'll take that. I'll take 680 something. Um, I got two full full days of driving ahead of me. I'll, I should be at my destination Sunday night and then do my 10 hour reset and deliver it in the morning. My plan to uh, stop at Barstow and get some Starbucks did not work out. That fell apart. Because as I got closer to, to Barstow, I realized I don't really want it. So that plan didn't go through. But I got some good driving in today. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Good driving. And for breakfast, I'm going to have ice cream. <laughs> yeah, I got, I got food with me, guys. Don't even worry about it, man. Um... So, I'm going to head off to bed, get my beauty rest. So, thanks for following along today. And, um, let's continue this party in the morning. In the morrow, shall I say. <laughs> I told you guys I would get ice cream for breakfast. I don't lie, I never lie guys, get that right. Oh boy, mm. Good morning, I'm in Midland, New Mexico where it's really sunny and a little bit hot inside the truck because of the greenhouse effect. <coughs> I'm getting ready to head out now, actually I'm fully ready. Uh, Pre-trip, breakfast, all that kind of stuff. I'm, re I'm ready to go man, I'm ready to roll. All right, today is going to be a very productive day because I'm driving through New Mexico and Texas, which means I'm gonna get a lot of miles in today, man. I'm shooting for 700, I'm shooting for over 700 miles. Yeah, I don't know what's gonna happen. It's just a pretty straightforward day, you know, just, just one of those where you just drive, where you just drive straight. <clears throat> and uh, hopefully nothing bad happens, you know? Because I've had my fair share. I, I think I deserve one day just smooth sailing. Kind of like yesterday. Yesterday was a pretty smooth day. I'd like for today to be that kind of day because I'm, you know, I'm trying to get a lot of miles in. Well, I'm going to quit rambling and uh, <clears throat> come join me in New Mexico and Texas and you know, Oklahoma. So I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm just going to quit rambling and uh, let's get this show on the road, huh? That's not so bad. I had some. I got some coffee from Dairy Queen this morning. And it was horrible. Oh man. I mean, even amongst truck stop coffees, 
Dairy Queen coffee was so bad. Well, I had a lunch. Had some of my food that I brought with me. You know, these days, when I run inside, I just end up getting coffee, and that's about it. And you know what? Not for long, too. Uh, I gotta get a kettle so I can boil water and make my own coffee. I have coffee beans with me. <coughs> Excuse me. And I have a way to prepare it, so all I need is a, is a little kettle, a little water heater thingy. And I'll be making my coffee as well. So, look at me, Mr. Frugal out here. Okay. Ah, let's see. Uh, I stopped in Santa Rosa, New Mexico, where there's an airport right next door, so no drone flying. Won't even let me take off. Um, and I got about eight hours of driving ahead of me, about 750, something like that. So I don't have to stop if I don't want to for another break. I'll see how I feel. Uh, but it's, it's looking really nice out there. I mean, look at this. It's just sunshine and like 60 or something. Really nice out here. I came a rolling into here uh, about five minutes on my ELD for driving but I found this hidden truck parking lot across the street from the truck stop there that one was full and this one was not even listed on trucker path it's just someone in Somebody wrote in the reviews of this truck stop, somebody wrote about this lot across the street. And it's right next to a McDonald's. So I guess I'm gonna go there tomorrow morning and get some coffee at McDonald's. Which is, you know, a step up from the truck stop coffee. So, you know, bonus there, bonus for me. Let's see, how many did I do? 740 miles I did today. Not bad. Not bad at all. Is this too bright? Is the light too bright? I don't think so. That's better. I stopped for the night in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Kind of a close call there on the ELD. 
Uh, but managed to find parking in the last minute, as always. Anyways, uh, thank you for tuning in once again, for subscribing. Oh man, <sighs> welcome to all the new subscribers. And uh, thank you for commenting. I am slacking off on replying. Not slacking off, I just, you know, can't reply during the day when I'm working and then at night I gotta sleep so I try to squeeze in some replies every now and then so again thank you guys for for subscribing and commenting and liking and um, it's just been really great for the past this past month has just been like really good on YouTube so thank you and uh, I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow and hopefully nothing happens <laughs> uh, well I bet you'd like for something to happen but I like it when I just drive you know that means I've had a good day anyway I'm gonna I'm gonna hit this pillow right here with my head uh, so to you I say good night and I will see you in the next vlog okay.